Hey friends, we are on our anniversary trip. Yeah. In good old Sarasota, Florida. Yeah. I am so excited. It's actually our first time here. Yes. And we um, uh, actually rented a Airbnb. Yeah, we did Airbnb for the first time. So it's someone's apartment we're renting out. It's really cool. Yeah, it's very nice here. We're in like the artsy we district. We are in Burn Square actually. Burn Square is the name of it. It's a historical district. And the best part, our apartment is on top of a bar. bar. Yes, very close to the beach. This is going to be a great. Yeah, we can literally walk. To the, it's right there, the beach. It's going to be a great time. Yeah. Happy anniversary. Thank you. And Gracie's all tucked in. Gracie is with us. Yes. <laughs> Carpe diem. Carpe diem. Let's go do this. And like I mentioned, it is our anniversary. We have been together for four years. Is that right? What? Four years, right? Oh, you. Four year anniversary? All right, yeah, it's the four year anniversary. So we're not gonna do a lot of vlogs. We're gonna do like two or three. And uh, one of them is we want to vlog our experience with Airbnb because we've never done that before and kind of show you what our Airbnb, Airbnb looks like. And if you don't know what Airbnb is, I mean, it's basically renting out other people's homes or apartments or vacation rentals some people just do this for a living they buy you know big apartment complexes and then they you know doll them all up and then no one actually lives there they just rent out it you know two or three times a day or anything like that so very cool and we got a lucky one because this place is phenomenal so we're going to give you a look at what we're experiencing here in this beautiful historical section of Sarasota. This place is just so beautiful. Literally, brick paved roads, art all over the buildings, rustic looking, I love it. And this is exactly where we are staying. And it's right above the fountain, which is a kitchen and wine bar, which is kind of funny because there's this really cool old looking fountain right in front of the fountain kitchen and wine bar and i'm sure we're going to be hitting this place up quite often we have already confirmed the bud lights flow like wine here we're going to cross the street actually because there's some really awesome art. building art actually all over the buildings even in our place that we're staying and i just want to point it out like look at this ouch how cool is that? I just smashed into that planter. Did you know? Yes, I did. Look at that, Sears Roebuck. Did you well, know that thought... Sears used to be called Sears Roebuck and Company? No, Nate, I'm not a, an old grandpa. Oh. But look at. That's, That's what Veronica favorite. is talking about. And Gracie's right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we are staying right here. The street is Pineapple Avenue. <laughs> It's so beautiful, isn't it? I mean, you guys are, it's like very artsy, like rustic and really chic here. Historic, chic. There's a lot of good different uh, words? words to explain it. And that is a uh, huge puddle. Yeah. I dare you to jump in it. You really want me to? No, but you can see the reflection of the camera from the building. What's to the that musically? I have no idea. Now that's what you need in a man. Oh. Someone that ties your shoe? Yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. You know what? Ladies, do it yourself. We're going to walk over because we want to show you our entrance of our actual staying residence. Is that an alligator chalk art? Yeah. That's really cool, actually. But it's so cool. Like, the storefront that? properties. The oh, yeah. Those, those are seahorses. No. Yeah, they're seahorses. No. Where do you see a lizard? That's definitely not a lizard. That one might be a lizard, but that was a seahorse. Yeah, that's not a lizard. Wait. Oh, I see a couple more over here, too. All right. 
We're coming up. Wait, look right here. On our building. Pretty, very pretty. Yes, very pretty. Very pretty. Can I move here and live here forever? I'm sure you would. I really would. And here it is. This is our Airbnb. Look at this. Bottle Blonde 76. Look at these are all plants. Plants, I love it. But what gets me is the entrance. Look at this. Wow. It reminds me of Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, it does remind me of Pirates of the Caribbean. The stairs are not supposed to climb like you in any way. I wish it smelled like okay. Pirates of the Caribbean. We're going to take a turn here. So cool. You know what I don't like? Oh yeah, there's a little painting of a bee up here. Oh, there's a couple bees on the walls. Yeah. B B B B. Oh, you know what I just figured out? So like that's Pineapple, that's Pineapple Avenue and then the orange was actually for Orange Avenue. And this is our place. Nathan. Look at that. So excited. Let's give you a room tour. Okay, we're in the Airbnb, and you ready for the big reveal? Ba -ba -ba -da! Look at this place. And look, Gracie's with us. Gracie Goo. Hi, little Gracie. It is so cool in here. I gotta show you the ceiling. Look at that. It has exposed beams, beautiful art. Oh, we're going a little fuzzy there. Nice furniture. Very cool in here, isn't it? Hot, actually. A little hot, but not too bad. This is the master bedroom. Wow. It's so cool. Yeah, it's crushed. I like the tree. I'm sure you love the tree, too. Oh, yes. And the view is actually of that camera and uh, that building of the old school city. Look at the roof. Yeah, the exposed beam runs through the roof here too. It's kind of cool because it's an open floor plan. We're gonna go, these doors actually shut their... Their door? Yeah, no, they shut their... Yeah, uh, yeah, they're like... Side by side doors. French doors? French doors. We're gonna go in the kitchen. Comes our microwave, stove. There's a goose in there. There is a goose. I mean, the kitchen's pretty small, but this is a lot bigger than a hotel room would be. Oh, there's coffee in here. How nice is that? Comes with a coffee maker, a toaster, stove, microwave. I love the kitchen countertop. Don't you? Yep. That is pretty awesome. And the bathroom has the highest ceilings I think I've ever seen. Wait a second. Whoop! That's crazy, isn't it? It's a little small, but it's perfect. Nice shower area, a stand-up shower. It's been a long time since I used a stand-up shower. Like not what? a tub, like a tub, not oh. a tub. And that's us. Hello. Oh, I look horrible. You look beautiful. <laughs> but it seriously is so awesome in here. It's gonna be great waking up tomorrow and just looking out on Sarasota. All of its glory. <laughs> Gracie likes it. Hello you. Nice bed though. Very comfy. Thank you. I like it a lot. Oh, also it does come with cable TV. Wi-Fi, all the things you need. I like it. Okay, so we're gonna try to head on over to the waterfront just to see if we can catch the sunset. Um, it's our first night, we just got here literally like an hour ago. So I'm excited to explore a little bit of the downtown Sarasota area. Going out Orange Avenue. <laughs> So you never get lost. Come on, baby. Come on, Gracie. Gracie is a little shy She's today. Gracie is so scared of the stairs that she is having me 
carry her like a little baby down the stairs. I know, don't, I'm not saying anything bad. I said she's just a little baby. We're gonna try and get to the ocean before that sunset, but look at the sky right now from where we're at. Beautiful, isn't it? Wow. Beautiful, isn't it? What you think, Gracie? I don't know. Huh? This isn't Gracie's first time at the beach. We brought her that. The first time we got her, we took her to the beach. This but isn't a beach, is it? Not technically. I mean, this is the ocean, though. No, it's I the think. Gulf. Or the Gulf. But man, it is beautiful here. Look at this. She just headbutted me like crazy. Look at your glasses. <laughs> what a big baby she's that. Look at her clawing into your arm. She's literally holding on for dear life. This is how scared our dog is upstairs. <gasps> baby. Oh my gosh. Daddy. You're going to make me walk up those scary stairs. We made it back to the fountain. Veronica is busy replying no, okay. to all of your comments. It's true, I really am. Oh, look at that. I'm ready to go back on our page this Yes, but we decided to come to the fountain to try Sarasota's best pizza. There's a sign outside, so I'm excited. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it's gonna probably be way better pizza than anything we have in Orlando because there's, literally nothing. there's nothing in Orlando. There's I really sometimes wonder like, what? what? Did we do wrong that we haven't lost weight since moving to Florida? I don't know. Right? Like, maybe we nothing we like to eat in Florida. I know. So we're excited. This place looks oh, fantastic. Oh, we like public subs. You do like the public subs. Uh huh. And, uh. Oh, wait, real quick. Oh, actually, I started out at that angle. Oh, you already saw that? Yeah, I said, sorry, we're closed. But still awesome. Here's a look at some of the offerings here at the fountain. Small plates, they have Brussels sprouts, broccolini, smothered meatballs, salads, pasta. Very small selection. Uh, their big thing is, I guess, the pizza menu. Uh, we went with a custom pizza and then we added meatball topping because I wanted to try the meatballs. But they also have white and a bunch of other ones. I'm, I'm interested in, in this bee sting pizza. It's mozzarella, fresh tomato sauce, pepperoni, garlic, red chili peppers, honey, and it's spicy and sweet. One thing I have to say. What's that? Paper straws. Ooh, paper straws. That's all I have to say. They have paper straws here? Well, that's pretty fancy. Huh. And... Their prices for pizzas are around like $15. I don't know what size that is. Um, something tells me they're gonna be a little bit on the smaller side, maybe like a 14 inch pizza or so. But we'll find out, you know? Oh, look well, yeah, at we'll find out right now. Here we go. Thank because you. there it is. You're welcome, enjoy. Do you wanna have another bite? Oh, yes, please. And there it is. A little bit on the smaller side. But uh, it looks pretty delicious actually, doesn't it? Oh, yes. I'm excited. That pizza is way too hot. And now we are gonna have to go through the agony of just, staring of at just it. sitting here and waiting for it to cool down and staring at it. Am I looking at right at you? No. Wait, here's to, here's to looking at you, kid. Here's to looking at you, kid. <laughs> Wait, let me see your face again when you said that. Here's to looking at you. Oh, very good. Al, can I get a sausage and pepperoni pizza? If you only use a paper straw. Thank you. Mm hmm. 
This is like Ninja Turtle pizza. Yep, this is right up your alley. Oh yes. Right up your alley. Right, right. Nom 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 nom. I love cheese. <laughs> it's very good. It's pretty good. Uh huh. <laughs> What'd you think? That the beer is great. How about the pizza? I my favorite part about it was the meatballs. <laughs> my favorite part was the meatballs, and you didn't like the meatballs. And my favorite part was the cheese. Strange. Um, and I wish it was a little bit bigger, but overall it was really good. Definitely, like I said. Way better pizza than anything we have up in Orlando. Would you like to meet my friends? Who's your friends? Mrs. Sock. Oh. And Mr. Pepper. That is Mrs. Parmesan. Oh no. And that is Mr. Hot Pepper. Very good. Scandalous <laughs> You want to see him do the chili? Yeah. <laughs> Overall, I really like that place, but I couldn't figure out what actually drew us here. And now it all makes perfect sense. Where is it? Oh, it's so stupid. <laughs> Hello, friends. We're coming at you live from the mean streets. Sarasota. No, that's it. Uh, that just wraps up our day. Like I said, we had a pretty, pretty exhausting day because I just got out of work this morning. We packed up, had to get everything together, and headed down here, and now it's like 9 o'clock and I'm old man-ish. So I think we're just going to go to bed so we can get a bright early start tomorrow. Yeah. So, uh, I love you. I love you too. I think I caught her off guard with that. Love the life you live. It's the life you love. We'll see you next time. Toodaloo. Toodaloo. So, I know I said we were going to bed, but we had to run to Publix real quick. And this Publix is on the second floor. That woman's stealing my car. And this is a like underground parking facility for Publix. How very, awesome very is very that? Strange. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that. So the grocery store is actually above us. Wow. Elevator and escalator to the grocery store. Look at the size of that elevator. Run. I'm coming in, I'm coming in. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> That's a big elevator. I'm sorry. <laughs> wow. Dang. Yeah, dang. Did you fart? No. Don't listen to her. That was so rude. I didn't smell it. That was so rude. Exactly. They have escalators for the carts. No way. Yep. No. Way. Remove child first. Okay. All right. Now position it. Okay. Okay. And I think it takes it on. Its ah! Oh! Be careful with my room. Wait. We gotta follow it. Go, go, go! Get back on. Get on the escalator. Go down further. It's beating us. Do not let the broom. I mean the the, the cart beat us. This is insane. I've never seen anything in my life it's so fascinating. Of your oh, you are too? Yeah! <laughs> you guys are fascinated with it too, right? What in the world? Thank you!